let's go get our hair done so travel with me over to my sister's house you guys where she is going to put in my crochets so as you can see your girl got the sit it off braids going on major shout out to toya Tress for sending over these crochet packs of hair you guys this hair is amazing it is called the tiana passion twist so let me give you some of the details about this hair so this is 100% human hair and the great thing about this hair is not like machine made or anything. It's 100% made by an actual professional stylist. So they would pretty much, you know, twist all this hair up by hand, okay? So that's why it looks like this. I've worn this hair to work and I'll tell you the girls at work love my hair. They love my hair. They've been asking me who did it, how long did it take? and all this other stuff, what type of hair did I buy so they could twist it like this. And I was like, y'all know, I got this hair pre-twisted. It came like this. Like, I didn't have to sit in a chair for hours upon hours upon hours. I literally had my sister crochet my hair in, as you guys can probably see here in this footage. It didn't take long at all. Well, aside from our talk breaks and food breaks and watching TV. All right, y'all, so I am just about to go ahead and style my hair, you know, because I just pretty much tied it up. And I have a little pineapple to get it out of my way. How beautiful is this hair? I have been getting compliments after compliment after compliment after compliment about this hair, y'all. And I'm just going to take a little bit of um, Edge Booster, Edge Control. This is the Maximum Hold. And spruce up my edges just a tad. Because they do look a little struggling. Right. So guys, I want to give a super major shout out to Toyo Trist Hair for sponsoring your girl's video today. So I want to tell y'all all the details about this passion twist hair. You guys, it is gorgeous. First of all, let's get into the color. Look at the color of this hair. I absolutely love it. It is perfect for, I guess, the end to summer, intro to fall type of hair. So let's go ahead and get into the details of this hair. So this is the hair that I received from Toyo Tress. It's called the Tiana Passion Twist. Guys, this hair is so nice. It's so bouncy and it has so much lust. It's full. I absolutely adore this hairstyle. Like, ah! I just want to show you guys the finished product about what this hair looks like. You guys, it's gorgeous. It's absolutely gorgeous. I don't even think that we used all eight packs. We were, I think we had got down to like our last, our sixth pack. And we were, um, I was just telling her, my son and my sister, that I really wanted it full so I can do this little flip over thing. And she was literally looking for places to put the hair into my head. So I got a total of eight packs. You really don't need, if you have a large head, then yes. Um, if you want it really full, then yes. But I don't think you need any more than eight packs to put in your head because you're going to get a nice full look. I love the pattern of these twists, you guys. Like, they're so nice and bouncy and springy. Um, and you can, it really looks like someone actually took their time and twisted this hair. I would probably never do individual twists ever again. Um, simply because you could just crochet these bad boys in there. And then you can also part your hair individually. 
and crochet them in too. I've had my hair like that before. Um, but I love it. Y'all see, I can't stop touching it because let's just look how bouncy and it just moves with you and everything. Um, the way that I have my hair parted with the straight backs, I could just, you know, put it down the sides. Of course, that shows y'all how big my forehead really is. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I can, I can bust me a middle part. It's still cute like that. I can flip it over this way if I wanted to. I can flip it over this way. I could put it up in a ponytail or a half, half up, half down type of style. Um, now, my hair is really, really short. If you guys are not new to my channel, then you would know. That I cut my hair a year ago and I have like a pixie type of style going on. So my hair was long enough to braid straight to the back. But um, we had a time connecting the braids, okay? We had time connecting the dots. But other than that, you guys, I absolutely adore, like I said, this hair. This style is super affordable. So let's get into the details about how you can get your hands on some of this hair too. So guys, not only does Toya Trace have beautiful passion to his hair, the Tiana Passion Twist, which is the one that I am rocking today, but they also have um, Bob Spring Twist, Goddess Box Braids, Ocean Wave Hair, Butterfly Locks. Y'all know the girls have been eating with those Butterfly Locks these days. Um, and of course, like I said, the Tiana uh, Passion Twist. So they have so many different kind. Um, their Goddess Box Braids are beautiful. Just imagine doing that with individual um with individual um, parts and then putting those box braids, the guys' box braids. Oh my God, that'd be so cute. But I absolutely love this hair, you guys, and I definitely want you guys to check them out. Of course, any discount codes, links, and all that stuff will be listed in the description box below. But y'all had to see this hair. Like, I'll just, y'all had to, okay? You had to because it's just that good. And I'm just, just, I'm, I'm wow that someone actually sat there and twisted this hair. And this is how they, you know, produce their hair, produce their hair. And I, I really, really love that because it looks like someone actually did twist my hair instead of me just buying the pack and sticking it in my head. So shout out to Toyo Trust for supplying your girl with this amazing hair. Shout out to my sister for putting my hair in. Y'all know, <laughs> know my sister is pregnant, so she actually stood up and did my hair. So shout out to her for getting me right. And yeah. And just for reference, you guys, I am wearing the 12 inch OT30 is the color. And this is the 12 inch in the Passion Twist. So this is how long we're going to get. Um, I actually really, really love the length of my hair. Um, typically, I am a long hair type of girl. Um, I love big, long hair. But I really wanted to kind of switch it up with this style. Something shoulder length is good enough for me. Plus, it's still hot outside. So, girl, ain't nobody got time to be fumbling with no hair on my neck and stuff all day. But I feel like this hair just did exactly what it came to do, what it needed to do. And the color, again, the color, it just takes the cake for me because the color is doing its thing. Period. Period. <laughs> Thank you to Toya Trust again up for sponsoring today's video. You guys are deeply appreciated and I absolutely love my hair. All right, y'all. Let's get back into the vlog. Orange. I want to change out the lighting so bad. But anywho, I took a couple pictures from my thumbnail. That's all. So that's why I got on close. This um, top does not really match this these pants, but they kind of really don't matter. <laughs> but yeah. Don't mind my children. I don't know why. I, I can't explain that. I don't know why it's there. Y'all gotta do something about these jams. <laughs> these jams are too big. <laughs> Lord. Jesus. All that wagon I am dragging. I thought it was about 20 pounds. It'll come on now. <laughs> because that thing is huge. I mean, I don't I don't know because I can't feel it. You know what? Well, I'm not going to say that because people going to be like, oh my God, you can't feel your butt. No, I feel my butt. Everything feels normal. But you don't feel the weight of your butt. So it's like you don't know how big it is until you actually turn around in the mirror and be like, that's, that's a lot of butt. <laughs> like, whoa. And don't get me wrong. I am not mad at it 
but do I really need all that bond? <laughs> I mean, I paid for it, shit, I like, guess I might as well just take it. <laughs> so y'all, I'm trying to figure out what I'm gonna do for the rest of the day. I don't really have much to do. I need to film some reels, probably. So I'm probably about to get my mirror over there and um, film a couple of reels, but I don't know what to film, but I don't wanna miss the um, reels bonus for this month, because last month my little reels bonus was too cute. I was like, come on, gas for two weeks. Hey y'all, <laughs> what's up my ladies? I'm back. Today is, um, why does it look so dark in here? It's, it's uber annoying. Um, today is, hump day, it's Wednesday. Ew, y'all, I got some collaborations to do. I'm collabing again with Zolfo and Shape LLXXL. I mean, LLX. <laughs> Got two here. I should have a list of them, so I'm waiting on some more stuff to come in. Let me cross one off the list because y'all, they ticked me off. But yeah, y'all, let me tell you about one of these companies that I would probably, most likely, of course, I never would work with them again. Because <laughs> I've worked with them on my channel before, and it's just like, y'all need to get y'all stuff together because I shouldn't be having to do all this. Um, So a company that I worked with before, a couple of times actually, Yes, I did reach back out to them and ask them if they want to work again because I'm in the creative spirit. I'm going to work. Um, so they said, of course, and they were like, hey, so we didn't see the last post that you did from us. I mean, for us. And we need to, you know, confirm that you did it. And I sent them all the links to it. And I was like, yeah, I sent this all the way back in May when I originally did it. You know what I'm saying? I sent them the video back when I originally did it. So um, I was like, no problem. I'll be, I'll be happy to go ahead and send you the links again. So this will be my second time sending them. Mind you, the first time I, I completed the actual collaboration and I sent the email to them, they never responded. So I was like, okay, that's quite odd. But I just, you know, let it go. Then when I, you know, reached out to them this time and I was like, hey, um, you know, I want to work on other stuff. They were like, okay, cool, but we don't see the video. So I sent them a link again. That's time number two. So I get it the first time. Stuff might be going on. Some got mixed up. So. I've been talking to them. They went ahead and sent me the link so I can pick out all the clothes I want. They got the email address, address, all that good stuff. Everything they needed to solidify um, how we were going to do the the collaboration. They got it. So I sent everything over to them. Now at this point, all I'm waiting on is for them to ship me the items. Yeah, I'll tell me why I got an email again today saying, hey, um, so for my last collaboration, we don't see what you posted the video also because you, you know kindly send us over the link whatever before we send anything out and i was like i pretty much got pissed off because i was like okay i just said i'm reaching out back to y'all to make sure to see if i can work with y'all or something like that but at this point this is my third time sending y'all the video link so i sent the link again and i was like this is literally my third time sending y'all this link and you know it's it's kind of ridiculous because this is my third time sending it to y'all y'all should be able to keep it with this some kind of way so she's gonna write me back basically saying that, you know, she's sorry and it was a, you know, a, a issue on their behalf. Um, but they should have never, you know, asked me for the link several times. They, they should have gotten it out and stuff like that. And basically saying it was their fault, whatever, cool, whatever. But I was like, at this point, I was like, I don't wanna do the collab anymore. Because if I gotta do all this, when I do get the items and I do post this, I'm really gonna have the same issue. I don't have time for that. And this was actually not going to be a paid club anyway. I just wanted to do it because I was in the mood of doing some fashion type of content. And I was going to do it. I wasn't worried about, you know, paying or anything. I was just going to do it and, you know, call it a day. But that was tripping. So I am exiting them off my list. It's okay because I still got one, two, three, four, five, six more collaborations for this month. Okay. That I got to do. Well, not this month, but next couple months. Um, and I'm trying to get up to at least about 10 so that way I can have a lot of content to post but there's two of them back there now these are some items that I got so I can have some with my birthday <laughs> um, but I just bought like three dresses from Fashion Nova I don't really know what I'm doing for my birthday I really want to just go and relax I'm, I'm not I'm not gonna say I'm not excited about my birthday 
I'm just like in a really funky mood about life in general because I just knew that I would be so much further and I'm not putting that pressure on myself. I know that it sounds like I am about having things done by a certain time. It's not that. I just, I really want to know my path and I feel like it's another year that's going around and I still don't know my path of what I'm trying to do. Like I think I do but I don't really know but I don't know, that's what me and God got to figure out, okay? So we're not going to get into that today. We're not getting that today. <laughs> I'm going to just talk to him about it. And then, you know, once he make a way, I'll come back and give him a testimony. But as of right now, yeah, we're going to get into it. <laughs> All right, here. I didn't get but three items. So, yeah, we're going to see what they looking like, girlfriends. Y'all, let me tell y'all about this thing here. Ugh. Don't go get no BBL or lipo and they suck that part out because apparently they forget. I don't know what it be, but it is huge. It gains weight right with you. So a lot of the times, it don't be my stomach that people can see. It be the hoo-ha. I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't get it. Don't get it. But this is cute. I guess I can wear this Friday night. Let's see. Oh, oh boy, this is this was this was a time right here, ain't it? This was a time. This was a time. Let me not break the button, Amber. Just open it up. Okay. Okay. And it's see through like nobody's business. Um. Y'all, what the heck is this? Just maybe, I'm not doing it right. Hold on. Am I supposed to take it and turn on this side? I don't think I am, but that's probably how I'm going to have to wear it. It fits so weird because this part up here is baggy, but this the seam in this is tight, so I can't go. I'm confused. What y'all think? It can still be cute. I, I can see where it'll still be cute. It's the hair throwing me off and me not having on proper undergarments, I guess. Angels keep calling. Okay, so this is where the count egg will begin. My, my tickle bitties will be out. So I would need to tape them up. Right of them. I don't think she did. Right. So this is what the magenta looks like. I like this one, y'all. I like it because it covers up everything. Of course, I would not wear this shirt. My 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 little bitties will be out, okay? But um, hold on, y'all. But um, I like this because anybody could wear it. If you got a little pouch or something down here, a little kangaroo pouch, can't about to see it because you know it's covered up. And then when you put on heels to elevate yourself, it's gonna look even nicer. So yeah, I actually really like this. It looks a little big, but if I went any smaller in size, I won't have any room to do this right here because this is kind of pulling me. And it'll be too short. It'll be too short, 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 short. But let me show y'all what it looks like in the mirror. So, this is what it looked like. It's gonna be real classy looking when I put my shoes and 
I'm not gonna wear this hair. Um, I'm gonna take this hair down next week, at the end of next week. That means I would've had it for three weeks. Yep, for three weeks. And then I'm gonna do my blonde wig with this. I think it's gonna be cute. I think I'll be okay. For 28th birthday, I want I don't want to do too much. I'm not doing nothing, you know what I'm saying? So but it's still cute. And this color just says everything. It shows mature and sexy at the same time. So yeah, I like it. <laughs>